I'm Caleb Dennison and welcome to DT Daily. Coming up, Chevy's crazy new concept car will knock your eyes out. This high-tech hard hat may be the coolest wearable yet and is Google about to launch their own cell phone service? We think it's gonna happen. Think the latest Lamborghini, Ferrari, or McLaren supercar looks like science fiction on wheels? Well, they look positively old school next to the concept car that Chevrolet just rolled out. Called the FNR concept, this showstopper had jaws dropping at the Shanghai Auto Show. Lambo doors, so 2001. FNR has dragonfly doors that open like insect wings. Laser beams light the way forward. Magnetic hubless wheels keep it moving. And wireless charging refuels the electric drivetrain. And check out the interior. Damn! These seats swivel so you can chat with your crew while the FNR drives itself. Or a human can also take control. This thing is amazing. Man, too bad it's just a concept. We think Chevy should put it into production immediately and show the world who's boss. Or, at the very least, the FNR should be in the next Tron movie, right? Each day seems to bring new wearable tech, but a lot of it is pretty forgettable. One that did catch our eye, though, is the Daiquiri Industrial Helmet, a very high-tech hard hat. That's right, the hard hat with a name like a fruity frou-frou drink with a little umbrella in it may feature some of the coolest and most practical tech we've seen yet. Inside the Daiquiri, drop-down lenses allow users to augment their view of whatever they're working on, whether it's an aircraft engine or just reading a really confusing gauge. It also sports four cameras that can feed video back to the home office. Tech on image recognition software, plus it learns to recognize tools and other worksite gear. Wow. A hard hat, who knew? Best of all, you kind of look like the guy who operates the Death Star's firing controls while wearing it. And that alone may be worth the price. All eyes are on Google as it prepares to enter the hornet's nest of cellular service providers, and the announcement may come soon, maybe even today. Rumors have pointed to Google launching their service, which has had project names that include Nova and Fi in the very near future. There won't be some big cell tech build out as Google service will be an MVNO, or in other words, they'll rent and buy cell service allotments from current cellular providers, including Sprint and T-Mobile. They'll also use Wi-Fi and other small carriers networks as well. You know, other cell service providers have got to be a little worried about a tech behemoth like Google getting into the game, and rightly so. A company with that kind of resources could drive down cell service prices in a hot hurry, and there's nothing evil about that. That's DT Daily for today. We'll be back with more tomorrow.